Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. This is the continuation of uh, gallbladder imaging. We have already discussed cholelithiasis and uh, today we will discuss cholecystitis. There are two best imaging modalities for the assessment of cholecystitis. Number one ultrasound and number two CT scan. When we compare these two, we will say that this is that is ultrasound is routine imaging modality while CT will be considered as best imaging modality and we know that normal wall thickening of the gallbladder should be less than 3 mm so let's see this is uh, ultrasound and here we have CT scan we can see that there is diffuse wall thickening on both ultrasound and CT scan and here we have um, inflammatory changes in pericholecystic space. So these two represents uh, cholecystitis. This is ultrasound of the upper abdomen. We can see there is stone in the gallbladder while mild diffuse wall thickening of the gallbladder is noted suggesting cholecystitis with cholelithiasis. And this is another example through ultrasound of the upper abdomen we can see a couple of stones are noted in the gallbladder while there is diffuse wall thickening and uh, we can also see sludge in the gallbladder so this is uh, cholelithiasis with cholecystitis on ultrasound here we see that uh, there is significant wall thickening of the gallbladder multiple fluid pockets are also appreciated in pericholecystic space and uh, we are unable to see any stone in gallbladder lumen so best example of a calculus cholecystitis and we know that uh, a calculus cholecystitis is uh, usually noted in diabetic patient and in those patients who are having some cardiovascular diseases here we have x-ray of the abdomen and this is uh, ultrasound we see a large rounded uh, calculus in the right hypochondrium and uh, on ultrasound we see that this is called stone with contracted thick wall called prader so this is uh, an example of uh, chronic cholecystitis with contracted gallbladder another example where we can see there is contracted in gallbladder with stone in it suggesting a chronic cholecystitis and now we will discuss uh, assessment of cholecystitis through a CT scan we know that this is a normal picture of gallbladder on the CT diffuse wall thickening is noted in these two images while inflammatory process is noted in pericholecystic space suggesting uh, cholecystitis another example where we see diffuse wall thickening of the gallbladder while uh, inflammatory changes are noted in pericholecystic space here we have uh, multiple calculi in the frontal region of the gallbladder so we will say that this is an example of uh, cholelithiasis with cholecystitis here we see a complicated cholecystitis where there is perforation of the wall of the gallbladder and bile is extra visited. Complicated cases can be assessed with the help of ultrasound and CT but once again CT is better modality for their assessment. This is an example of uh, emphysematous cholecystitis which is basically a surgical emergency and is produced by the gas forming organisms and this can be seen with the help of x-ray of the abdomen and ct when we compare these two modalities we will prefer ct over x-ray while because of presence of air in the wall of the gallbladder it is difficult to assess emphysematous cholecystitis with ultrasound so emphysematous cholecystitis is a surgical emergency and best modality for its assessment is CT scan. Thank you very much. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.